would Minecraft be like with Pokemon in it? Well, that's where the Pixelmon mod comes in, allowing you to get Pokemon-like creatures in Minecraft. Now, in this video, we're going to be installing the Pixelmon mod pack, which doesn't just have the Pixelmon mod, it has that as well, but it also has a lot of other mods, at least a few other mods, to enhance the Pixelmon experience and make it more fun and enjoyable to play. It is also from the original creators of the Pixelmon mod, so it kind of takes what they envision and gives you the best version of it. Now, in order to install Pixelmon, we're going to need the Curse Forge Launcher. To download the Curse Forge Launcher, you're going to want to go to the second link in the description down below. That will take you here. This is our complete text guide on getting Curse Forge, but we're going to be covering everything in this video as well, so don't worry too much about it. Just once you're here, click on the Download Curse Forge button to be taken to the official Curse Forge download page. Once you're here, you want to click on the Download Stand Alone button to start downloading Curse Forge right away. And while this is downloading, how to mention our company, Simple Game Hosting. Go to the first link in the description down below the breakdown that XYZ slash SGH to start your very own 24 hour DDoS protected Pixelmon server. Yes, you can easily play the Pixelmon mod pack with your friends in just a few clicks. Literally, just select it in our one click mod pack installer, click install, and you're good to go. Pixelmon is added to your Minecraft server. From there, you and your friends can join it and play Pixelmon together. And should you have any issues along the way with your server, there's expert live chat support and a high quality help center to help you out. So go check out Simple Game Hosting at the first link in the description down below the breakdown that XYZ slash SGH to start a Pixelmon or any other Minecraft server with mods, plugins, other Curse Forge mod packs, or other mod packs in general for you and your friends. Curse Forge is now downloaded. We can go ahead and minimize our browser, and it's going to be located in your downloads folder. I'd recommend moving this to your desktop, but you don't have to. Double click on the CurseForge Windows installer that you downloaded. It's then going to open up the CurseForge installer just like this, where you want to click on Next. Click on I have read and agree to the terms of service here. Click on next again, and now CurseForge will install. It is literally that easy to get CurseForge up and running. Just click next a few times, accept the terms, and boom, CurseForge will install and open up right like so. Once it's open, what we want to do is click on Minecraft here. It's grayed out right now. That's because we've not set up CurseForge for it yet. Let's go ahead and click on Minecraft. Just click on Standard Recommended here and click Continue. Once everything is ready, what we want to do is come up here to the top and search for Pixelmon. So we're going to search for Pixelmon right up here at the top, and we'll have the Pixelmon Mod Pack. We want to make sure it's the Pixelmon Mod Pack as the title, and then come over here to the right-hand side and click the Install button. From there, Pixelmon's going to install. You can sit here and watch it, or you can go back to the My Mod Pack tab by clicking over here on the left-hand side, the little Minecraft icon, and let this install. Pixelmon's pretty fast, so it's already installed, and all we've got to do is click on Play here, and it's going to open up the Minecraft Launcher. Now, you'll probably need to log into the Minecraft Launcher, and that's perfectly normal. So Go ahead and do that. This is the default Minecraft launcher that you normally use to play even vanilla Minecraft, except now it's going to have the Pixelmon mod installed on it. So log in to your Minecraft or Xbox account or Microsoft account, and then once you log in, it's a normal Minecraft launcher. From there, you just go ahead and click play, and Minecraft is going to open up with Pixelmon installed. We can then immediately see that it's installed, things look different, and if we go to multiplayer, I went ahead and set up a server while it was loading on Simple Game Hosting, and we can join right on into it. It. One of the cool things about Pixelmon is that when we join in, we can immediately select our Pokemon that we want, or excuse me, our Pixelmon that we want. Uh, I want a Charmander, and we're, we're good to go. We are now in-game, and we can start getting things going with Pixelmon. So if you've got any questions, let us know in the comment section down below, and enjoy the Pixelmon mod pack. It's honestly one of the coolest mod packs out there, in my opinion, and it's awesome that it's so easy to play it with your friends as well, and like you can all interact with Pokemon and all that. It's great. So go check it out if you haven't already, but I'm guessing you have because uh, you just installed it. We'll see you in the next video. I am out. Peace.